When it comes to air conditioners, proper air filter maintenance is critical to energy efficiency. Van Meter expert Casey Favre can help you take the right steps in preventative maintenance on your system. Here we're going to be showing you how to change out your air filter and uh, your uh, air handler or on your HVAC system for your entire house. In addition to energy efficiency, Casey highlights other benefits of changing your air filter. You want to clean the air, purify the air in your house um, to get the dust and particles and things like that to keep them from recirculating through the home. Another is prolong the life of the system. Uh, you don't want all that dust going through the air handler or through the fan, um, getting on the, the wiring and everything else in the system. It's going to really cut down the life of the system and the end more than likely cost you money. In fact, changing the filter and choosing the right one can save you money. All of our homes are supplied uh, are a Goodman product. What we use or what the manufacturer recommends is really a lower end filter. Yes, the basic inexpensive filter with the accordion style mesh overlay. The reason we don't want to use a, let's say a hypoallergenic filter or a high level filter, um, they clog very quickly, especially I know in my case, uh, I forget more often than not to change out my filter. And if that is the case, then you're really, really laboring the system and, uh, and uh, causing it harm. To get started, simply locate the filter door connected to the air handler. If the furnace is running like it is right now, it might be a little bit tougher to change, but that's no problem. Just make sure that when you're putting it in, you're careful not to bend it. Now, what's important here is the airflow, okay? So where you see the duct line running into the air handler, okay? The air is flowing through the filter into the big gray air handler here, all right? So that is the direction that you're gonna put your airflow marker. New homeowners, you should change your filter every month due to the construction dust. After construction in your area stops, you can go to a quarterly schedule. A good indicator, and the reason that I like this style filter is because it is white, okay? A good indicator is when the color changes, um, it's evident that there is dust or particles in the filter. Either way, this is a simple task worth being proactive about. A lot can get trapped in your air filter with moisture and can build up bacteria, mold, mildew, odors, and allergens that can blow right through your system. So go ahead, don't waste time. Start protecting your system, your home, and your family today. <music>